Fishlingers is a 10 minute mini game that you can play every 15 minutes. It's 10 minutes per game, 5 minutes in the lobby. This is used to get the fisherman outfit and you can also receive up to 20k XP per game depending on your fishing level. I'm not going to go into the details on how to play the mini game, but if you have any questions, simply go into the French chat to fling fish and they'll get you started on the mini game and let you know how to go through it. So starting off with the basics from 1 to 10 fishing, we'll be fishing shrimps south of Draenor village. These are approximately 10 to 12k XP per hour. Make sure you do have a fishing net in your inventory or on your tool belt. A familiar with you, your fishing or shark outfit if you have those. Head to the south of the Draenor bank. There will be two to three fishing spots here. Just right click those, they will say net and bait. You're going to click to net and then you'll start catching them. Now if you don't have the shark outfit, you have the option of just dropping these because they're not really worth that much money. However, if you do have the shark outfit, it is advised to use the consume option. That way you can pretty much just AFK until you finally hit level 10. From level 10 to 30 fishing, we'll be doing sardines and herrings. This is roughly 15k XP per hour. You'll need a fishing rod, fishing bait. Make sure you bring your familiar, your fishing and shark outfit, and any fishing urns if you want to bring those along with you. We're going to be heading again to the south of Draenor Bank. This time, instead of caging the fishing spots, we're going to right click and choose to bait those. At this point, you'll start catching sardines and herrings. They're only a few GP each, so it is recommended to drop them or just use the consume option on your shark outfit if you have that available. And that'll help you speed your way along to 30 fishing, and then we'll go ahead and move on to our next thing. From level 30 to 60 or 70 fishing, we're going to be doing fly fishing. This is roughly 50 to 70k XP per hour. You'll need a fly fishing rod, feathers, you want to bring your familiar, your fishing and shark outfit, as well as a few fishing urns if you've brought those along with you. The best place to do this is to the east of Barbarian Village and to the south of Edgeville. Once you get to the fishing location, you'll want to right click the spot and click on where it says lure. This will allow you to start catching trout and salmon. Trout and salmon aren't worth that much, so it is recommended if you don't have the shark outfit to put them on your ability bar and just go ahead and drop them. If you have the shark outfit, however, just go ahead and use the consume option. That'll make sure that you get to AFK just a little bit until the fishing spot actually moves. As a money making alternative, you can do 60 to 70 fishing by fishing lobsters. These are roughly 40 to 60k XP per hour. You'll need to have a lobster pot, your familiar, and your fishing or shark outfit. The best location for this is going to be to the south of Catherby if you're only at level 60. Once you hit level 63, you can use an Admiral Pie and boost and go inside the fishing guild until you do hit level 68. These are two great locations to fish these as they are relatively close to a bank, and this does make quite a bit of money as well as XP per hour. It is relatively AFK, however, if you're not interested in the money making method, you can obviously switch to consume the fish. However, if you're going to do that, it is best to just do fly fishing all the way to 70 as the alternative then. From level 70 to 90 or 99 fishing, you can do barbarian fishing. This is 90 to 105k XP per hour. You'll need to have the Barbarian Rod, which is obtained from doing Auto God Blessed Barbarian Fishing Training. You'll need to also have Feathers. You'll want to bring your Familiar, your Fishing Outfit, or your Shark Outfit if you have that available. And simply use a Game's Necklace and teleport to the Barbarian Outpost. Run south from the area that you teleported to. Once you are there, you'll notice there are several fishing spots that have the Use Rod on them. Simply just start using the Rod on it. At this point, you want to go ahead and put the Leaping Trout, Sturgeons, and Salmon on your ability bar if you don't have the fishing outfit, and just start dropping them from there. This is really good XP per hour. It's not exactly AFK since you kind of have to pay attention to it, but if you have the Shark outfit, this is definitely the best place for you to be. So this is what you'll do from 70 to 90 or 99. For those that want to make a little bit of money while they AFK, 90 to 99 fishing will be spent doing rock tails. These are roughly 35 to 40k XP per hour. They require a fishing rod, living minerals. I would recommend bringing a familiar, sign of the porter, the fishing, or the shark outfit to increase your XP per hour. Now the only location to do these are going to be down in the living rock caverns. To get there you need to run south from the Edgeville Lodestone past the monastery, up near White Wolf Mountain, and then go into the Dwarven Mine area. Then go over to this little rope right here, climb down, and you'll be in the Living Rock Cavern. From there, you'll need to run to the south, and here you'll just be looking for where 
the majority of the players are. This is a very popular place to train fishing because of the money that you can make per hour. Like I said, it's not exactly the best XP per hour, but the money that you can rake in while AFKing watching movies till 99 is pretty good. You'll just need to find the Rocktail Shoals, bait those, and from there you'll just start catching them. And if you are using Sign of the Porters, that'll take care of the banking for you. Once you run out, just rinse and repeat the process, getting more porters and coming right back. For those that want to make a little bit of profit once they hit 62 fishing, you do have the ability to fish monkfish. These are less than 30k XP per hour depending on your level, and you can make up to 142,000 GP per hour. You do have to have the Swan Song quest completed. You will also need a small fishing net. I would recommend bringing a familiar, the fishing or shark outfit with you as well. The only location to fish these is inside the Piscotoris fishing colony. It is best to get there using the fairy ring code AKQ. Once you have completed that, you'll be able to run to the northeast, go into the little tunnel, go through the doors, and then go to the north of the bank area. You will see a few fishing spots. These will have a net and a harpoon option. Just simply click net and you'll start catching the monkfish. Again, this is a little bit AFK, it's not the best XP, but it does put a little bit of money in your pocket. Don't forget as well, at level 76 plus fishing, you have the ability to fish sharks. These are roughly 13 to 17k XP per hour, depending on your level, and you can make up to 172,000 GP per hour. For this, you only need a harpoon. If you've done barbarian fishing, then you have the barehanded catch. This requires a 96, however, to do the barehanded catch. It is also recommended to bring a familiar, the fishing and shark outfit with you. The best location to fish these is going to be inside the fishing guild. You could reach this by going north of the Ardun lodestone. Once inside, just right click the spots until you see a net fishing spot and a harpoon fishing spot and just start catching them. Pretty much that's all you'll have to do. Uh, it is recommended to use sign of the porters on this, that way you don't even have to travel to the bank. You can pretty much just AFK catch sharks. And for those that wish to do it, from any level to 99 fishing, you can do C2 fishing. The amount of XP you receive from this is dependent on your fishing level, however you can receive up to 120k XP per hour. What you want to do is once you go inside the dungeon, you're going to select C2 and select any floor that you want to do. Then you're going to just sell some stuff, buy a few feathers, and then you're just going to proceed to the dungeon as normal. However, once you've cleared each of the guardian doors, once you come to a fishing spot, you're just going to start fishing it. Now just keep in mind that if you have two fishing spots in the same room, one of these fishing spots is going to have halved XP. One of the fishing spots will give you full XP. So it's entirely dependent on your level, on how much XP per hour you'll get. So there you go. Alright guys, so once you've finally achieved 99 fishing, you will then be able to purchase a fishing skill cape from the Master Fisher inside the fishing guild. You'll also get this sweet little emote that goes with it. But I would like to thank you guys so very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click that like button. If you found it informative, click that like button. And if you want to see more guides and videos from me, then please click that subscribe button. Make sure to also comment down in the comment section below what skill guide you want to see to 99 next. On the right, you can see all the skills that I currently have a 99 in. Just leave a comment, let me know what you want to see. For those of you that are probably going to suggest a ranging guide that is already in the works, since that is going to be, going to be one of my Combat 99 guides coming up. So, go ahead and comment anything other than the range, and I'll see you guys later. As always, I have been Rage Asaro, teaching you a work smarter, not harder. Peace!